Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. Now today we are going to be talking about the NASCAR Sonoma and Mid-Ohio uh, weekend that happened obviously like for well, today or well, yeah the Cup Series race today. Uh, but first but before we go on to the results let's talk about the Texas, the, the Texas weekend. The Texas, oh my god. So, so the Texas weekend um, is obviously where the All-Star weekend is, um, will be starting. So on Sun, so on Saturday, sorry, it will be the Campbell Truck Series and the Xfinity Series racing at Texas for the Truck Series for the run of the Speedy the Speedy Cash uh, 220, and the Xfinity Series for the running uh, for the running of the Asco Uniforms 250. Now for Sunday it will be the Cup Series weekend, and so first will be the All Star Open, where the drivers who I'm trying to remember didn't score a win. Um, Last season wasn't uh, di didn't get a pole, didn't get a championship, um, didn't win another uh, a an all stars race. I can't remember. It was one of them. Um, so basically, how it works is that I think a total a total of three drivers will advance. The first one who will advance on the first segment. So, 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 so whoever finishes first in the first segment, whoever finishes second, so first on the second segment, and the fan vote winner. I think, I hope that the fan vote winner is Timmy Hill. If it's not, I'm going to scream, but I pray it will be Timmy Hill. And then it will be the All-Star Race, which is like the championships, the wins, um, uh, playoffs, you know, all that other stuff. So... So this weekend, so for NASCAR Cup Series only, this will not count for points. The Xfinity and Trucks, they will, they will be counted for points. The Cup Series won't be counted for points. And this is also the final weekend for Fox Sports, which is when then NBC will then um, take over for the rest of the season. I think for all three series, if I remember correctly, but I need to have a look. So that is the Texas weekend. Let's now move on to the... Well, firstly, the Xfinity Series results. And for and the Xfinity Series results at Metal Ohio, it was won by AJ Allmendinger, who actually had a penalty, but then somehow, I don't know how, but he came back to win the race. Second to him was his colleague racing teammate, Justin Haley, then Ty Gibbs, Brandon Jones, Andy Lally, Brandon Brown, Michael Annette, Josh Berry, Ryan Sieg, and Josh Williams rounding out the top 10. Then Alex LeBay, Daniel Hemrick, Jade Buford, Austin Sindrick, Cody Ware, Jeb Burden, Gray Golding, Ryan Vargas, Matt Jasko, and Landon Castle ran out the top 20. Notable finishes outside of the top 20. In 21st place was Riley Herbst. 27th place, Miguel Paludo. 29th place, Maya Snyder. 31st place, Brent Moffat. 35th place, Justin Allgaier. 38th place, Harrison Burden. And 40th place in Plum Loss, Noah Gregson. Now, I will, I'm trying to remember all of the events that really happened. But what I can remember is that obviously lap one, Gregson uh, ran a little bit wide exiting turn one. And that uh, caused him to go up onto the AstroTurf and da damage the front end of the splitter. Um, uh, I can't remember what happened to Harrison Burton. I think he just... I think he... Uh, was stuck on a gravel trap, if I think, if I remember correctly. Uh, I, I think I remember, but I think he was stuck in, in the gravel trap. I can't remember what happened to All Geyer. I think Moffat was stuck in a gravel trap. Um, I don't know what happened to Snyder. I know Miguel Paludo, he had, had a couple collisions. He was stuck in the in the gravel trap, then he spun out. I think in the last lap, the last couple laps of the of the race. And then Riley Herbst and Austin Cindric, they had a collision. Um, it was after restart. Oldman Nigger made put a three Y in turn one. Um, he came out in front, and then there was basically literally just a lot of ping pong going by, uh, going up behind it, which caused um, Cindric to spin out. And then I think later Herbs spun out um, on turn two or well, in hairpin. I think turn two or turn three. I think it's turn two if I remember correctly, but that's what I can really remember. Felt the qualify was only three of them. The number 13 of Timmy Hill, which I thought was in the race, and I think, but I, th I think it was originally David Starr, he was who failed to qualify, but then he drove for now, but now he drove for Hattori Racing Enterprises, and, and the number 37 of Dylan Bassett, obviously. 
So that is the Xfinity series. We now move on to the Cup series and how many more races is this man going to take? Kyle Larison wins at Sonoma for running of the Toyota Save Mark 350. Oh yeah, I also forgot for the Xfinity series for running of the uh, BNL Transport 170 at Ohio. A. John Benegal won Stage 1 and Justin, and Justin Haley won Stage 2. For uh, the Cup Series, both stages were won by Kyle Larson. That's how dominant he is now. So second to him was Chase Elliott, his teammate, then Mark Trex Jr., Joe Logano, Kyle Busch, Kurt Busch, Ross Chastain, Denny Hamlin, Alex Bowman, Ryan Blaney ran out the top 10, then Eric Jones, Daniel Suarez, Austin Dillon, Bubba Wallace, Brad Keselowski, Chris Buescher, Chase Briscoe, Corey LaJoy, Tyler Raddick, and Cole Cursor ran out the top 20. Uh, notable finishes outside of the top 20, 22nd place Kevin Harvick, 24th place Christopher Bell, 27th place Eric Amarola, making his first ever Cup Series start, Ben Rhodes in 30 in 30th um yep 30th place, then 35th place Ben Ben Rhodes William Byron. Uh, so events that happened in Sonoma, I'm trying to rethink as I literally just watched the fucking highlights. God save me. Um, first of all, there was a pretty big collision with, with Ricky Senhouse Jr. I think he just put too much power on on the in turn one, and it just pancaked the wall, went off track, which caused him to um uh to actually finish plum last in 37th place. Uh, I think Quinn Half, I think he spun out somewhere. I actually can't remember. Um, Ryan Freeze, he spun out in the S's, and the, but then he tried to go on track. Cody Ware, um, came in, uh, just, uh, just came from behind, hit him in the rear end, and I, I think both of them retired, if I remember correctly. Um, there's been, there was a lot of shoving, a lot of spins, so it's mainly in the hairpin, turn 11. Most notably in the last lap, when Suarez just punted, my, uh, McDowell out of the way. I think Newman also spun out as well. Uh, so, that was, so, so that was all in the last lap. So a lot of drama there. And there's probably, probably some fights going on as well. For that, that happened um, off camera. So yeah. That's all the number of events I can really uh, remember. And yeah. So w let's now go on to the standings. And the standings. Denny Hamlin still in the lead. Chase Elliott second. Chase Elliott second, Kyle Larson second, obviously, then Chase Elliott, William Byron, Joe Logano, Martin Trex Jr., uh, Kyle Busch, Ryan Blaney, Kevin Harvick, Brad Keselowski, Alex Bowman, Austin Dillon, Tyler Reddick, Chris, uh, Chris Buescher, what the hell, uh, Christopher Bell, and Michael McDowell running out uh, the playoff picture. Um, drivers who are looking in. Matt Benedetto, Kurt Busch, Ricky Sanders Jr., Ross Chastain, Bubba Wallace, um, I think Bologna Suarez, yep, Bologna Suarez, and other names as well. For the playoff picture, Kyle Larson in the lead, with Martin Trex Jr. in second, the Denny Halen, Chase Elliott, Joe Logano, William Byron, Kyle Busch, Ryan Blaney, Alex Bowman, Brad Kozlowski, Michael McDowell, round out, sorry, Kozlowski rounding out the top 10, McDowell and Bell, round out the drivers who is officially in. Then Kevin Harvick, who's probably most likely in as well. Chris Buescher, Tyler Reddick, and Austin Dillon. I think Dillon... I, I think Buescher may be in it as well. I don't know. Well, actually, I, I think... Maybe Dillon may be in it, but I don't really know. So, that is the the Cup Series standings. Now we move on to the Xfinity Series standings. And Austin Sindrick still in the lead. With A. John Meninger second, then Daniel Hamrick, Harrison Burden, Jeb Burden, Justin Haley, Justin Allgaier, Brennan Jones, Jeremy Clements, Michael Annette, No Gregson, Molly Snyder ran out the top 12 playoffs. And Brennan Brown, Riley Herbst, Ty Gibbs, Josh Berry, Ryan Sieg, Landon Castle, Alex LeBay, Tommy Joe Martins ran out the playoffs. I guess the noble outsiders. Here's a playoff picture currently. Austin Sindrick, A.J. Omeninger, Justin Allgaier, Daniel Hembrick, Jeb Burden, Justin Haley, Harrison Burden, Molly Snyder, Brandon Jones, Noah Gregson, Jeremy Clements, Michael Nett right now with the playoff picture. So, that is, um, yeah, 
that is it for the uh, for Sonoma and Mid Ohio, if I remember correctly. So the Texas weekend will be the final weekend for um, Fox, and then it will then um, transition to NBC, if I remember correctly. Yep. So it will then transfer to NBC, and next race uh, and first race for NBC will be um, Nashville. Wow, look at that. Nashville, Tennessee. So Nashville Speedway will be back in the um, in the lineup. So. That is it for me now. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Catch you guys all next time in the next one. Goodbye.